Now, the San Francisco Public Utilities District has finished a state-of-the-art $30 million project to help get fish up and over one of its dams. KPIX 5's John Ramos was the first media member to get a look at this. In the 1930s, they created this small dam as a place to siphon water off of Alameda Creek for San Francisco's water supply. But when they did, it instantly became the end of the road for steelhead trying to swim upstream to spawn. Steelhead are simply rainbow trout that managed to complete an ancestral journey back to the sea. But for 90 years, generations of trout in the Alameda Creek watershed have been stuck below this small diversion dam. In 1997, the fish became a threatened species, requiring the district to protect their numbers. And just this week, they opened the flow on a brand new fish ladder to finally get the steelhead over the dam and back to their spawning grounds. It's always amazing when you get to the end of something to see it working. Um, this is my first day here. It's the first time water's been in the ladder. The water flowing under these steel grates is intended to mimic a naturally flowing river with narrow areas of rapids, but also swirling pools that allow the fish to rest. And then when they're ready to go through the next slot and go a little bit further upstream, they'll burst through and then rest again. The ladder is only part of an entire steelhead monitoring program. Biologists have installed rotating fish traps downstream where they can capture trout and microchip them. Then when they swim past these sensors in the ladder, they are recorded just like Fast Track does with cars. That will help scientists to better understand how the fish are moving up and down the creek. Once we see that first fish arrive, um, it's really going to improve the likelihood that they're going to be here in the long term for our kids to see. And it makes me feel like, you know, we turned that corner. Now we want to see the biology part happen. We, physically, it's working. Water's here. We want to see the fish come into the system. We want to tag the fish and be able to track them also through the system. And now, by getting above the dam, the steelhead will have 12 miles of new habitat in which to spread out, get strong, and the hope is repopulate the species. The fish still can't come all the way from the bay because of three obstructions in the Fremont area. But once they complete fish ladders there, they will finally be able to complete the journey that is imprinted in their very DNA. At Alameda Creek, John Ramos, KPIX 5.